Hey everyone, this is Julian. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to a very special travel with Julian. As you can see in today's video, I'm back in the States. I'm here at our Las Vegas house for the work week and I wanted to pause my regular upload. Travel with Julian Kenya is happening right now, which happened a couple of months ago. If you look on my timeline of the vlog channel, Right now, we're doing the end of August because I daily vlog my life and my solo travels around the world. My vlog channel naturally falls behind compared to the main channel. But I wanted to pause everything right now that's happening on Travel with Julin and do this one-off of video because I think if I wait till when it chronologically happens on the vlog channel, it'll be sometime at the end of the year and maybe it won't be as relevant or maybe I will have already moved on and I wouldn't want to have to see this video then. So in today's video, I wanted to just do a special episode of Travel with Julin, visiting this beautiful chateau in rural France and spending four days at Lalan. And you will eventually see Travel with Julin France, which I think will be towards the end of the year. You'll get to see me revisit Paris after 11 years. You will see me explore different villages, towns in the area that is surrounding Lalan. All of that will go up as scheduled once I get there in the timeline of my travel year. So probably at the end of the year, you will see that. But in today's video, I wanted to just do a special video sharing my four days at Lalan. And I did film a story time in the room that I stayed at right before leaving the chateau to head back to Paris to share my story on what it was like uh, from beginning to end getting there and all of that so that I could attach it to this video but for whatever reason those clips are missing from my memory card so here I am fast forward days later sitting down and refilming it now so I hope you guys enjoy today's special video and when we are done sharing my four days in Lalan, I will wrap the video here to do a story time. Enjoy. Hey everyone, this is Julian. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to Travel with Julian France. I am wrapping my time up in this beautiful country outside of Paris. And if you are familiar with this very iconic chateau, then you know I am at beautiful Lalanne. It is in October. There is just like some misty vibes happening with the rain. The chateau is super quiet right now because Stephanie and a bunch of people are not here. to share what I can share on the vlog channel, my time here in Milan and this part of France because it was definitely very stressful to get here and I, I suggest that you have patience if you're going to get a rental car and drive here because that's the only way you can get to the chateau is by taking a train from Paris if you're flying in from Paris and then driving out to Lalanne and that's exactly what I did and it was definitely a mission to be here so I will share as much as I can hope you guys enjoy today's episode all right so this is the road leading to the chateau all right it is very in the middle of nowhere I think I might freak out when I see the chateau in person This is what's right outside of the chateau. Oh my god! I'm here! Wow! Wow! It doesn't seem real! I'm freaking out. All 
Alright, I just got a tour of all of the places that guests can uh, walk and enjoy on property. What I can share, I will share. And I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I can't believe I'm here. It is so beautiful. And the weather is not the greatest, but it just feels like I'm like in a fairy tale book, really. It's so quiet here today. And I look like a wreck. We definitely need to change. I don't look like I belong at a chateau with this hoodie on, but tomorrow I'll be looking a lot better. I'll get some pictures of me. So beautiful. I can't believe it. The pea chicks are huge. Wow. And there's Thor. Some of the chickens hanging out. <laughs> To have this point of view behind me on the channel seems so surreal. It's drizzling, it's very quiet, nobody's here. I can't believe I'm here, so let's uh, do more exploring and walking. Just put makeup on. They're so cute. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I dressed up and I have nowhere to go. I just felt so awful in that hoodie. I was looking pretty crazy rolling out of bed in Paris on three hours of sleep. That was not good, but I'm here, I'm dressed up, <laughs> making use of my tripod because this thing is so heavy to travel with but I try to take it everywhere with me so I can get content because I'm by myself. Morning, look at these cuties. Good morning, good morning cuties. Mm. Looks wet outside. All right, good morning vlog and welcome back to There I Am. Another travel with Jolin, France. And I'm so happy to be here. Let me show you today's look. This look, I'm just wearing my vintage pullover and my Jewel of Hawaii earrings. It's really cold outside. So let's see what's going on. And the beautiful flowers, so pretty. So pretty.
you guys are so cute. They're big. Wow. my boots on and my trainers umbrella tripod water just in case we're gonna go for a little day trip to Lamage and I'm super excited to see the surrounding areas so here we go I don't think I'll ever get over all of the mirrors here in the land they're so beautiful oh my goodness no big deal just starting my day here in the land I feel so so blessed to be able to come out here and spend some time just to see it in the background of my video wow so cool a little good morning from the land so beautiful wow i don't think i'm ever going to get over seeing the land in person it is so beautiful like honestly I can't. It's so beautiful in person. And to see Aloysius outside the window of my room. So cute. So, here we go. At some point, I will do a walk if the weather clears up for me. So, here we go. Day trip to the mall. The chateau. It just doesn't seem real that I'm pulling up to this chateau. <laughs> and I'm back at Lalanne. It just feels so weird that I can say that on the vlog. And my boots is making this walk <laughs> very loud. Um, as you can see, the vibe of the chateau right now. It's very chilly, cozy, kind of one of those days where you just want to sit somewhere quiet and drink a cup of tea which is probably something I'm going to do I'm going to treat myself to do that at some point today but it's honestly such a dream to see the courtyard like in person and to be able to have it in my vlog what is going on with life? life is so crazy I plan on sitting by the fountain before I leave it's so cute also the bench, I remember that in one of Stephanie's vlogs. So cute to see it in person. Uh, so now I'm gonna work out and then group dinner will start. I changed and I am going to take my chances and do a walk. Although the rain is coming down, that is so unfortunate. Take a look. It's raining, it's so sad. Ugh, I'm so gutted. cute are the hedgehogs they're so cute at some point i'll walk through the chapel but oh my goodness <laughs> why do you have to rain Lalan? so pretty but i want to do a walk if it's just raining what can i do and look at my footwear it's going to get dirty, I have a feeling. I'll be very careful. Ugh. So beautiful. Ugh. All right. I'm gonna try my best to do a little walk in the rain. If I feel like I'm getting really dirty and wet, then I'll turn around. So pretty. Look at this. I love it. Look at the ferns, so pretty.
seems very surreal to be walking this trail right now. I believe if I'm not mistaken, I think Salmar was parked back there at one point when he was here. It looks like that to me. Okay, walking underneath the trees is not that bad with the rain. So pretty. I mean, just the little details of the path. Look at how pretty. Here's the bridge. Always see this on the vlogs. Mm. I love hearing the noise of nature, the wind going through the trees, the raindrops. Look how beautiful. I could definitely make some fun art with these ferns. Look at how pretty. Oh my goodness. Let's walk to the end of this path and see what's here. I believe this is where they do the Easter egg hunt. If I can remember, this looks like it. This looks like a chicken house. Or is this the bees? No, it's an empty chicken house. It's a nice one. So it looks like there's kind of a path going this way and there's another path this way, but let's turn around because I know from one point of view, I don't know if it's from the trail here or on the other opposite side of the property, you can see a nice point of view of the chateau. So let's do that. Look at how pretty. It seems so surreal to like be here. Very nice. It's very relaxing and peaceful. Very cool to be here in person. So, we're gonna go back this way and I'm gonna see what the other side of the path looks like. I'm looking forward to group dinner. So, here I am, back where the bridge is. So let's go this way and see where it takes me. Look at the little mushrooms. <laughs> look at, look at them. 
They're so tiny. Oh, the rain is coming hard. Perfect place for dogs to run. Hmm. So it looks like the path. goes all the way this way but I'm just not too sure how far it goes it's getting dark and I want to get ready for dinner I just was curious to see what was the path looking like and it goes all the way there. All right. Well, maybe tomorrow morning, if the rain is not that bad, I'll come and I'll continue the walk this way. Um, so let's go back to the chateau and get ready for dinner. So pretty. Wow. So pretty. dress for dinner I'm wearing my socks because I just want to be comfortable in the chateau so socks it is but I'll show you my outfit for group dinner I specifically wore this blazer for the chateau so here's dinner's outfit of the night I, I'm wearing vintage everything except my earrings and my headband but I absolutely love my vintage peacock blazer I have a vintage blouse with lots of lace and then just high-waisted navy vintage pants. So cute, so outfit of the day. You can see my blazer, so cute. Love it a lot. I'm trying to think where I got this blouse from. It might have been maybe from, I don't even know. I thirst so much, but this one for sure I got in Southern California. And then the pants I got thrifted from a thrift shop in Arizona for sure. But this is today's look. So cute. Love it a lot. Alright, cheers to group dinner. The table is set so pretty. I love all of the details. Orange juice. I wanted to share with you the beautiful details. Uh, love it a lot. Look at the little peacock napkin ring holders. So cute. I love it. Love the plates. Also, look at this. So pretty. I love this jewel tone color. One of my favorite colors. And cute this one too. Oh my oh, goodness. goodness. That is beautiful. I could tell you something normal, but we are at oh. La Land. Yeah. Oh my god. So <laughs> in, in, yeah. um, in the words of Voltaire, do you mind? cultivate your garden. Uh, uh, gosh, it, it, you made it on purpose. It looks lovely. <laughs> It's a, it's a carrot. You can eat the tops of the carrot if you oh, want. It's you? very fragrant. It, so it's a, a goat, goat cheese with um, chives. There's a bit of a tomato jam at the bottom. Edible soil. And you've got um, edible soil. Um, <laughs> <What was that? laughs> 
<laughs> is it flaxseed? No, no, it's, oh. a lot, it's a lot of, uh, it's a, a composite creation. Okay, soil? Um, <laughs> and then radishes and um, carrots, tomatoes and salad from the garden. That is beautiful. Thank you. Thank wow. You. I, I think it's more I don't know. Uh, deconstruct it and eat it as you like. You wanna just, uh, is this edible? Mm -hmm. The flowers? Yeah, mm -hmm. Everything but the glass. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. You said it was edible dirt? Yes, yeah, and I want to know what, what is it? The dirt soil. Um, lots of different things. Mm. Um, Go without it. Yeah. Mm. She, she's yeah. <laughs> you, 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 you can put, mm. put the cheese mm. on the carrot, whatever you like. Mm. Yeah. Mm, not really, not really. Where is the mm. carrots from? From the garden. Okay, cool. Mm. All, the, all the vegetables and the salad is from the garden. Can I put in wine? Yeah. Mm. yeah. It's so cute. It's so, so cute. <laughs> I'm sorry, you know red, but you have some red. No, we'll have sugar salt. Have you had soil before? No. Did you whip it? We whipped it. Yeah. We've always been. Yeah, the district. Right. We've never sat down. For You've never sat here? No. no really? I've never sat for guest meals. Oh, welcome. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> true. We've got both. <laughs> the uh, pesto is um, lemon, verbena, and hazelnut. Wow. Um, using the verbena from Dennis. Right, Dennis <laughs> got He lives here. It was a lovely, lovely house. It was a guy from the Netherlands who married with um, a woman from Costa Rica. Maybe you have the most delicate nose I've ever known. No, 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 but that was. Honey. It was so, compost so, outside mm -hmm. the door. Mm -hmm. Like tons mm -hmm. of compost. They have a factory of mushrooms. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know, right, I live, I live next to a pig farm. farm. <laughs> well, yeah. That's the thing, I'm a city girl. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thank, Thank you. you. Oh, yeah, Madeleine's are homemade, of course. Yeah. <laughs> wow. I'll just take some cutlery. Oh, sorry. It's okay. Amazing. <laughs> I was really hoping there was going to be figs tonight. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> figs from our yeah. Yay! <laughs> and then the, um, these are lavender medlins with the lavender oh, sugar yeah. bar. No way! The lavender from here? Yeah, from here. Oh, my heart! Yeah. <laughs> and uh, they're quite very yellow, you'll notice, because it's our eggs that have very, very potent yolks. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, lemon lavender medlins, lemon sorbet, we have a lemon cream. Um, it's like a curd. Mm -hmm. and then it's, very nice. it's amazing. See it though. It's always there. It's always like cooked with a little wow. bit of mm -hmm. syrup or sugar. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, what's mm. underneath? Yes, what's the? It's like a it's like a lemon curd. They call it a lemon, a lemon cream here, mm. but essentially it's like a runnier lemon curd. Mm -hmm. yeah. Wow. Mm. Delicious. Are you going to take a break from cooking, or are you going to go back and cook for your family? Um, <laughs> they think that's the idea. I'm very much hoping for the opposite. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and so we'll see what happens. <laughs> your mommy watching the vlog and saying, oh, why don't mm -hmm. you do that? Yeah. You never could cook like that for us. <laughs> well, that's what Maybe they should say the first time. <laughs> Um, and then I did a few dinners for them, mm. like we do here. Mm -hmm. So I did like the table and did a whole blonde hair, mm. blue so eyes, cute. six foot two. So Thank you. And it's not that she had a problem with Germans, but it's just. Um, yeah. Oh, it's yes. open. Yeah. Yeah. It's uh, open. So, so they're, they're all open. open. Are they it's all like open? a sleeve? Yeah, it's a sleeve. Yeah, okay. It's so cute. Around France, around France because uh, my grandfather was uh, was an officer in the French army, mm. and all of his all of my uncles, his children. They then pursued careers in the military as well, so yes. they've been stationed all over. Mm -hmm. All of my uncles have been born around the world. Mother was born in uh, Madagascar. Nadi. 
Is this honey from here or no? It's a little honey. Oh my god, my heart. <laughs> State tours, stations right. in all the French colonies, so all wow. the uncles were born all over the world. Really? Yeah. Born in, born mm -hmm. in France. Mm -hmm. Isabel wasn't, nobody was. What's your mother saying? Hey, vlog, it is a few minutes after 10, and I finally had a group dinner here at Leland, and just like walking to the group dinner and then walking back to this room to like settle in for the night just seems so surreal to like be walking in the hallways at night and it was so nice i'm so glad that there was figs and goat cheese and the honey from here it was just very surreal even the lavender All the details and um yeah it was just such a great dinner very intimate because there's not a lot of people here and the two guests that are here it, one of them is neighbors with the one volunteer so it's a very small and intimate and um, yeah not a lot of people are here i was able to capture as much as i could at the group dinner so hope you guys enjoyed that and uh, tomorrow i am going to be going on another day trip hopefully to find something really cool at that miu's which is the one that stephanie vlogs at and i'm hoping i can find something vintage in that town um, but that is going to wrap up today's vlog. I really don't know how I'm going to put these videos together with my time here with Lalan. I think that I will make a separate video of my time in Lalan and then of course my daily vlogs, Travel with Julian. So maybe you'll get two videos out of my time here. But that's going to wrap up today's uh, day in the life, Travel with Julian, France. Lalan edition. I am in this beautiful bed feeling like a princess. It's so cute to be able to open the window and see Aloysius and his crew just chilling. They're just absolutely adorable. Tomorrow I would also like to go into the gardens in the greenhouse. That'd be super cool to share on the main channel because that is plant life. It's a definitely different plant life from the plant life I do, but it's also very inspiring to see it in person because I've been seeing it on Stephanie's vlogs. But that is gonna be it, guys. I hope you enjoyed hanging out with me, exploring what's around the area, and then just like being able to come here and stay and like be here in person at Lalan is very special, but it just kind of seems like a museum because Stephanie and Philip is not here. Um, it's so quiet, you know, normally on her vlogs, there's tons of people, so much activities happening, and uh, none of that is happening because they're not here. So it's so, so quiet. And, um, you know, maybe one day when I come back, there will be more people, Stephanie and others here, and it'll be fun to like, you know, join in on one of like a theme party or fire pit outside. Those are like the things that uh, come to mind when I think about the Lalan vlogs. They're like little special things like that that only kind of happens in places like this. Um, but I'm still thankful that I'm here before the season ends. And um, yeah, I have two more days here. So that is going to wrap up my outro for today's vlog and if you're new welcome to the channel subscribe for daily uploads between the main channel and the vlog channel you get a video each and every day i'm gonna take all of my makeup off i'm gonna shower and i am gonna edit for this channel until i fall asleep and when i get up in the morning we'll start another day here in lalan i will see you tomorrow until next time good night from lalan bye that is gonna be it for today's video i hope you enjoy seeing part one of my time here in Milan. It was very, just so surreal to be here. I honestly can't believe I'm actually standing in front of this fountain, in front of the chateau, looking at Thor and the peacocks and all of that. It's definitely a very surreal moment. Aloysius is like outside my window. It's just so, so cool to be here in person. And I would love to come back in the future uh, because this is definitely a treat to be here and also to be able to share a little glimpse of my time here in the land on this channel so hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me and if you're new welcome to the channel subscribe for daily uploads between the main channel and the vlog channel you get a video each and every day aloha from the land in france bye guys